What's going on guys, it's Eric. Welcome back to another Beat Saber modding tutorial. Today, I'm gonna teach you guys how to mod a Beat Saber for version 1.6.2. Now, if you guys are like, wait, where did 1.6.1 version go? Well, that version disappeared. It was a small hot fix that was released earlier today, at least half an hour before recording this video. I do just wanna say if this video does help, make sure to leave a like and consider subscribing with post notifications on so you guys can keep up with the latest modding tutorials. Anyways, let's get into this one. So as we can see here over at Steam, Beat Saber version 1.1 was released and then today, just literally about 40 minutes ago, we got another update. But don't worry, the mods from 1.6.1 do work on version 1.6.2. I have updated it, even though it doesn't say update, it just says install. I have already played Beat Saber on version 1.6.2 with the mods from 1.6.1, so this does work. But today, I'm gonna be using Mod Assistant. But anyways, guys, let's jump into it. So if you guys are a past modder, make sure to move all of your custom folders out to your desktop or a safe location, and then uninstall Beat Saber like I already have here we'll just take the beat saber folder delete it but make sure to just right click beat saber go to manage and then it'll say uninstall right there even though i don't have it installed after that just go ahead and click that beautiful install button place it wherever you need to put beat saber make sure that you know this file path for me it's under my ssd under my steam library my steam apps my common folder and then this is the beat saber folder which all the files will appear in from here we need to press play at least once and you can do this on the oculus store or on steam whichever one you prefer or whichever headset you have as we can see right here we do not have any sort of camera plus mod so we are not able to actually have mods just yet it's very shaky but if we can see to our left here it was a version 1.6.2 that was just released it's just a couple bugs and everything that they squashed so let's go ahead and quit right here let's actually mod beat saber all right so if today is your first time ever modding beat saber this is the website we're going to go to and we're going to be downloading an application called mod assistant this is the latest version and down here this mod assistant.exe we're going to click on that to actually download the application this is what the application looks like I already have it on my desktop i'm gonna open it right now and as we can see it is on game version 1.6.1 there is not a version 1.6.2 do not freak out this is totally fine. Go ahead and go to the options tab right here and make sure that your install folder is in the correct folder that Beat Saber was downloaded to. For me, like I said in the beginning of this video, it was under my D drive, Steam library, Steam apps, common, Beat Saber, and then this is all of the files within Beat Saber. Make sure to just put that file directory right there. You can select folder, open folder. After that, go ahead to the mods tab right here and we do not have many mods. If we can go back to Steam real quick, 1.6.1 was released on January 7th. Today is the 9th, but a 1.6.2 patch was released literally 45 minutes ago so there is not many mods available at this time if you guys want to learn how to download custom songs slash custom levels or even download custom sabers things like that i will make new videos and make sure to smash like and tell me below if you guys want me to make those videos anyways go ahead and in the all core and libraries and tweaks tools make sure to select all of those boxes and hit install or update from here that command prompt will open up and we can see in our file right here we do have a lot more beat saber files this is a lot of the uh, mod files and I just want to say this plugins folder here, this is your mods folder. There's nothing in it just because we need to actually run Beat Saber in order for the mods to get injected as we can see right here as a .dll file and that is the actual mod file in our Beat Saber folder. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have successfully modded Beat Saber for version 1.6.2 and we can see at the top that there is a mods tab. Boom, and we have the more songs options to download more songs, but I'll make another video of how to download other custom songs, things like that in the future. Finally, really quickly, I just want to say if you did have any of your custom folders that I told you in the beginning to drag out to your desktop, make sure to go ahead and put those in so you already have those saved. The custom campaigns, notes, platforms, and sabers just go in the regular Beat Saber file, and the custom Beat Saber data, the custom levels, and the work in progress songs, both of these go in the Beat Saber data folder, so make sure to put them in their correct place. Anyways, guys, that was literally all. It was super simple, super easy to mod Beat Saber for version 1.6.2. Now, if this did not help, make sure to leave leave a comment down below and let me know what went wrong so I can help you mod Beat Saber for version 1.6.2. Anyways, if this did help, make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button with those notification bells on so you never miss another Beat Saber modding tutorial. Anyways, guys, this was Eric and I will see you in the next Beat Saber video.